And I know what you're probably wondering. Is it Frederick Douglass? Nah, bitch. <laughs> it's me with my motherfucking fro. Let's go. No, because baby, look, why Miss Natalie be eating? Because, yay. I run my city from the west side. Big to best, I do a day to shake. Queen Louisiana, Dr. Dre, the Los Angeles. This is it, bitch. Michael Misfit, huh? Day a legend and moonwalk. Sliding across the stage in 87. This that Tupac out the window. Both hands throwing up that middle finger. Fuck them other niggas, ratchet bitches. And my demons, yeah, I'm queen. Yeah, welcome and welcome back to another frugal gal hairstyle video. Now, as you can see, this is real cute right now. How I look, right? Right. Okay, but when I hit the swivel, bow, bitch, please. Bitch, the, my ass curl fucked me up. My part is in shambles, bitch. My wraparound is giving ground beef. I was not impressed when I seen the back of my head fucking finally. So... And I did not know that until I kind of looked back at this video. So what the fuck did I do? My hair over. <laughs> now, of course, as per usual, let's get into these products. I got my number two her trio pack of hair. Oil for the hair. Uh, Black Panther. <laughs> Wakanda Forever. 11-11. Make sure you get some tickets. We got rubber bands, hair pins, and uh, combs. And, you know, edge brushes. The usual shit. Uh, so, bitch, so since we do not waste footage, Monica, uh, what I'm definitely gonna do is still give you the video anyway, but it's gonna be sped the fuck up. Why? Because uh, we do not waste footages. I don't give a fuck if the hairstyle fuck up or not. Bitch, I don't record shit that I'm not finna go ahead on and put the fuck out. Why? Because we got memory cards and shit don't nobody got time for. I'm not working for free. I'm not recording shit that I'm finna just fucking delete. Okay? So, let me get into the story time. For some odd reason, you know how a lot of us be forgetting that our parents was kids at one point in time, teenagers too, and we be trying to be slicker than a can of oil, bitch. I tried Linda Faye one day, okay? Try Linda Faye, and the saddest part is because of my own oblivion and the fact that I legitimately was not no bad child, bitch, I didn't know how to be bad at least, like, in silence, you know, way back then. That was before my kleptoism phase and all that other shit. Then not only that, back then, my self-esteem wasn't what the fuck it should have been, bitch. So I was surrounding myself around a bunch of using motherfuckers on purpose just to say, I got people around. Bitch, then when I realized, you know what, that's another story for another <laughs> Another story for another day, bitch, because I was going to go completely left, you understand me? But anyway, so... Had a little crush on this dude or whatever back when we all used to stay in the same apartment complex together. Eventually, when a bitch got old enough, you know what I'm saying? Now that ass poking, now everybody want to hug. Face ass nigga, now all of a sudden nigga want to talk to a bitch. Then not only that, word had spread around the little neighborhood or whatever that I was getting my apartment or whatever because I was all excited and shit. So I'm outside telling motherfuckers, right, right, so... All of a sudden, nigga takes interest in a bitch, okay? Not realizing this nigga needs a scapegoat to a scapegoat. Yeah, goddamn, let look like to get out of his motherfucking mom house. Oh yeah, bitch, slicking the fuck out of that hair, okay? Slicking the fuck out of it for it to draw up like coochie hair on me later. But anyway, back into the story. So, child, one night the motherfucker called me and my mom and them got into it, man. I ain't got nowhere to go. I just need to give me a shower, give me a little sleep, blah, blah, blah. So, I know, bitch, I'm getting my apartment in, like, three, four weeks, okay? So, fuck it. Y'all, Mike had to help me braid the hair. Why? Because my jaw was locked the fuck up thanks to this arthritis, and I could not put my braid in my mouth this time, bitch, okay? Anyway, so, bitch, I decided I'm gonna be nickel slick with a can of goddamn oil, you understand me? So, me being who I am, oh, you done got into it, you know, you you can't stay with me, but, you know, you can at least take a shower and get you some sleep and kind of put your head on right, bitch. I'm saying this shit in my mama house. Yeah. In my mama house. I opened up my mouth and said this bullshit, okay? So, when I said the bullshit, Brought him to the fucking house. Y'all already know if I'm using Eco Style, the helping is a heap. Anyway, back to the story. Brought him to my mama's house, bitch. So again, A, I'm sneaking a boy into my mama's house Why my mama is in the house and she's asleep. Because I know by now Linda Faye gone to bed. She got to be up for work by 5. She don't come in my room in the morning, child, because she know I work at night and I go to school. So she ain't going to come in that room and bother me. So I'll be able to get this nigga up out of here by the time. She, as soon as she leave for work, that nigga got to go too. Or he going to have to leave before she leave. But Linda Faye used to get up and walk around the house singing hymns and all kind of shit, child. So I knew better. And if I knew better, I would have do better. 
I would have do better. Is that okay? They go together. I don't really give a fuck. But yeah, you get what the fuck I'm saying, child. I knew better than what the fuck I was doing. Bitch, let me tell you how I knew better. Okay? When I would get off work, I would go in the bathroom, take my shower, give me something to eat, go in my room, go the fuck to bed, bitch. On this particular night, I decided with my slick, smart, dumb ass, the way I'm going to sneak him in here is to make sure my mama sleep. How did I make sure my mama sleep? Not by doing my usual routine. Hell, quite frankly, getting in the shower with that nigga. Because if my mama would have came out, you know, in any, I'm already wrong. Okay? I'm already wrong. I'm already in trouble if I get called. Whatever's whatever, bitch. I, I got my place coming in a minute anyway. So I ain't got to ask. I ain't got to ask shit. Why? Because I'm moving out soon. Bitch, look at how slick my motherfucking head is. If that shit ain't Wednesday Adams in, take that shit down. Wash it out. Ain't no reason for your... My hair curls the fuck up immediately. If you did not notice when I put that eco style on, child. My hair curls up immediately. When Look at how I come through that shit. Slick them high. Okay, anyway, back to the story. So, child, I walks my what, what, perfect patty, punk ass in the goddamn room because why? I'm going to make sure my mama sleep. Okay? I'm going to make sure she done laid down. I'm going to make sure she 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 is, is uh what what's that shit called? Laying her burdens down. I want to make sure her loins is resting. So, in me being nervous, because I don't do shit like this, I go in my mama room. Everything quiet. My mama sleep. Normal people would have turned around and walked out the room. But what did I do? Mama, you sleep? Yeah, man, I'm sleep. What's wrong? Oh, nothing. I'm finna get in the shower. Oh, all right, man. Bitch, I wish I had my mom here to tell y'all this story, but I couldn't cuss if she was right here. Bitch, my mama said the next morning, as she laughed, after she put him out, oh, because he had to go. My mama said, and that's something my spirit told me, get up out the bed. Because I do not go wake my mama up to let her know, A, I'm home. B, I'm finna wash my ass. C, I'm finna eat. You 18 years the fuck old, girl. Shut the fuck up and do what you're doing. Hmm? Hmm? You're 18. Go ahead on and do what you're doing. Bitch, about three minutes after I went in there and did all that hollering, because mind you, he's getting in the shower while I'm taking to make sure the coast clear with my mama. So I got the, he got the water on. I'm trying to make my mama think I'm just heating the water up if she get to asking questions and shit, okay? Bitch, I'm laying up in my motherfucking room. I got on some regular ass pajamas, the girl. But back then, my mama I swear up and down the shit was negligee. Girl, I wasn't finna do no fucking in your house. A right hand for Jesus. There was finna be no fornicating in your motherfucking house. If anything, I was gonna lay pretty next to that nigga. But uh, it wasn't finna be none of that. Why? Because my mama whooped ass. Okay? I was already in trouble. Why in the fuck would you risk your life? Like this behind a motherfucker that you not even going to know his middle name in six months. Anyway, bitch, I heard that bathroom door open because, mind you, we was living in the projects at the time, girl. So that ba Now, look, that's a camera trick. You see how frizzy that braid is up close? Look how frizzy that braid is up close. And, bitch, when I pull that shit back from the camera, it got a piece of lint hanging on it and some more shit. Now, watch when I pull it back from the camera, bitch. You can't tell none of that shit. Be aware. Always be aware. So, bitch... I hear my mama open up the door. And my mama said the first thing I did in there was look down on the floor and I seen the biggest pair of basketball shorts. I heard my mama say, sir, whoever the fuck you is, get your shit and get the fuck out of my house right now. Immediately, I can taste my neighbor an asshole at the same time. And baby, you ain't never been in no trouble if you ain't never been able to taste your neighbor and asshole at the same time, clean or not, bitch, I can taste and smell that shit in my mouth. You know how you say something tastes like shit and you ain't never ate doo-doo? Bitch, I ain't never ate a neighbor or an asshole. You got me fucked up. But I can taste both of them all at once. Bitch, when my mama never came in my motherfucking room and he never came in my room either, I just knew when I woke up, I was going to have the hell beat the fuck out of me. Child, my mama took off the next day. When I woke up, she was in that motherfucker too. Good morning.
What the fuck was you thinking about last night? Trying to get some dick? I said, no, mama. That was not the case. He needed a place to stay. She said, well, Nat, I was getting up in a few hours. Why didn't you just let me? Why in the fuck would you come in there and say anything to? Oh, your ass don't know how to sneak and do shit. You're not that kind of kid. Sit your punk ass down so when you bring another nigga in this house for motherfucking free, I'm going to punch your ass in the face. My goddamn <laughs> Baby, when I say Linda Faye was mad at me, child, I never did it again. Never. Never did it again. La next man I brought home was Mike. Bitch. I I'm not playing with Linda Faye. But there she go, bitch. Real quick, little hairstyle. Real quick, little story time. Okay? Mike was in there fucking with me. But right back into character. Love y'all. Bye.